Welcome, Night Initiates, to Trial 5, Cosmic Chemistry. At the Galactic Night, you will come in contact with many chemical substances. Chemistry is the combination of substances to create another substance. Many substances react together. This trial, you're going to explore two chemical reactions to create polymers. You must do this trial with your spirit guide. Neither of these polymers can be eaten. When you've completed, please make sure you participate in your reflection so you understand the deeper meaning of what you have learned. With that, let us learn how to do cosmic chemistry. All right, Galactic Initiate, here we are at trial number five, cosmic chemistry. I think you're going to enjoy this one. Uh, before you start, you're going to need a few things. Uh, before we open up, you'll need to bring back your glue. This will be an, an important prod, uh, piece that you'll have. And you, this one you have to do with your spirit guide because you're going to use a chemical called polyvinyl alcohol here. Let's see, uh, You may want to also um, work with some gloves. Oh, also you're going to need um, four cups of slightly warm water. Um, I just run into hot water, put it in there, it's fine. Um, you know, you, you should be able to put your finger in it, okay. And then you're going to need another cup or a bowl or, or, or uh, mixing thing. So lots of pieces to this one. All right, so let's see, what else do we have in, in the packet, uh, your trial packet? One is the instructions, All right? So it's always good to read through these, set them off to the side for now. And then um, you have um, green food coloring. And yes, you get to keep this and you can put green food coloring on anything. Um, pancakes, eggs. It's, a, it's This is, it, as opposed to the polyvinyl alcohol, it's safe to eat. Um, and uh, But it makes a heck of a mess. Oh, by the way, I put down this aluminum foil. Uh, you may want to do, go thicker than um, newspapers because we're dealing with liquids and you're going to get drips so you'll probably want that and maybe you'll, you, it'd be helpful for you to have um, you know some napkins or tablecloth or uh, paper towels as well all right all right what else we have all right so we have this is basically uh, it's called the thorax it's a type of laundry soap all right um, but it reacts really interesting with things like glue and polyvinyl alcohol and we're going to make some polymers. And polymers are a chemical that happens when uh, organic molecules gather together and create a um, long chains of, of molecules. It's a, they end up being kind of like um, slimy or um, kind of like uh, bubble gum and that type of stuff when we're done. So when we're done today, we're going to make green slime and white silly putty. Right. The other thing that you're going to need, so you may want to run, oh, and, and we have a couple stir sticks, okay? I'm going to put one stir stick over here, and I'm going to put one stir stick over here, because I don't want to mix them, all right? So first thing I want to do is I need to make my borax solution. So, um, again, this workspace, by the way, may end up getting a little sticky as well. All right, so you've got your, your um, and again, this stuff doesn't hurt you. And again, just put one tablespoon. you got extra, so you get to make more later, okay? And you just pour it into the warm liquid, okay? And then I don't need this anymore for now, so I'm setting it off to the side. And I'm going to set the borax over here for now. I don't need that anymore either. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stir this. So we're going to come back to this one. We're going to make green slime first. Okay. Good. Stir it up there. Good. You won't, by the way, you'll, you'll still have some little crumbs at the bottom, which is fine. I just like to stir it really good the best I can. All right. So next, and again, I'm going to keep this over here because I want that for that and this for this. I'm going, I have my polyvinyl. And what I want to do is pour all of this, all right? And again, this is where you're going to need your adult partner's help, and I'm going to pour that all into my other container. Okay. See, 
it's just a liquid, it's a little thick. Alright, and close that up, you don't want to spill that anywhere. And then, um, now what we're going to do is we're going to drip some green food coloring into this mixture. Okay, so here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, try that. And then use your stir stick. Stir it. All right. I like that color green. I suppose if you want it darker, you can put more in. Um, but I think that'll do just fine. So just kind of see how that looks. Again, it's just a liquid. All right. So now what we're going to do, and this is going to go pretty quick, we're going to just take our tablespoon now, and we're going to grab a tablespoon of this borax solution and pour it in here. Okay, and let's start with two because I know you'll need more than one. So we'll start with two, and then just start to spray. Turn, turn, turn. Goop, 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 goop. If you look, it starts to do it already. Okay. Goop, goop, goop. Keep going. All right. Just keep stirring, 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 stirring. Looks like to me, I would go with. I'm gonna go with another one. Changes from time to time. Keep stirring. You'll know it. When, when, when it doesn't slosh around and it all could kind of pick up into one piece, you know you've got there. So I think, all right, see, I think we're there. All right? So just for fun, I'm going to pour it over here onto my. Okay. All right, here we go. Here comes my slime. Look at it, pretty much all of it came out. All right, and you can kind of continue to move it up here, or this might be the fun time. All right, let's put this away. And now you can just play with it. It's goopy, you know, you can touch it, feel it like this, move it around your hands, make a ball, it wiggles like this. I think it's kind of fun too um, to just, you know, move it around and play with it. At this point, you, you really shouldn't eat this. I mean, it would taste horrible, um, but it, it won't hurt your skin. It's basically just soap now. It's basically goopy soap. Um, so, uh, but you can play with it all you want. It's kind of sticky on your fingers. And uh, uh, again, it's a lot of fun. Now, when you're all done playing with it, okay, make sure you go wash your hands and then you can put this in a Ziploc bag. I'll show you that here. See how it's turned into its own little blob here. All right, so now we can just kind of roll this up and pick it up. Yeah, let's see how nice it is that I put all this in a bag here. But it, 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 the nice thing is, is that you can keep them and, and play with this later. Um, and your It doesn't. It's not too bad on your fingers, you know. And if you, it it shouldn't turn your fingers green, but it might if you use way too much uh, green food coloring. So, um, and that just means you just need to wash it really good. But again, for the most part, this is soap. All right. So you can see this now, and it's kind of cool. If you leave stuff on it, it'll take on the shape of of that thing. So you leave it on here this for a while, and then all of a sudden it looks like that in the slime. So anyway, this is fun. Just a fun, and that's your first polymer that you made, green slime. And again, I think it's just kind of fun to play with. I, with my hands and goop it around and, and things. Just make sure you wash your hands really good after you're done with them and, uh, and move on. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make Silly Putty. All right, so what you're going to need for the Silly Putty is your mix here and your washable glue. All right, so this white glue that you have. Now, don't use all of this. You still need to use the glue for one more trial. But you can use a bunch of it. So, I mean, there, you've got a lot of glue left. You shouldn't have used that much for the other project. So, um, um, now you could choose to turn your glue green. It wouldn't hurt the other project either. Um, and, and make green silly putty. However, I like white silly putty. So, if you want to make green silly putty, then just pull up the top of your glue and then pour this, the um, green food coloring in here. 
and then you can close this back up again okay and um, and then um, and then just kind of shake it around and, and squeeze it and, and kind of mix it in there and if you need to you could use your um, uh, like a, a straw or something to, to make it work all right so there you go so now here's how it works and it's gonna go pretty quickly all right all right so let's take this and uh, your water here and go ahead and you, you want to stir it and, and and stir it kind of fast you're mixing it back up again but it's this it's the movement of of the solution that's going to be very helpful so you know stir it like that and then once you're done go ahead and pour in your glue you can see as it spins around and spins around and spins around what's going on there I don't know all right yeah, just kind of keep going for a while make sure you get enough all right and then just keep spinning with your straw at your stir stick and pretty soon it will kind of connect all to your stir stick and there you go now it needs here first thing you get when you pull it out okay is that you're going to need to be squishing it okay so kind of squish and squish and squish all right you need to drip back in again squish all right and squish okay and you want to just keep squishing it right now it's it feels kind of goopy and, and stuff like that but you're going to want to keep moving it around mixing it together so i just like to keep squeezing it and squeezing it and squeezing it pretty soon it shouldn't stick to your hands or, or to anything anymore okay it should be, feel kind of warm because the water was warm and so you just want to keep kneading it together all right and then as the water kind of comes out of it you move it around all right then you can just kind of keep you know bending it and folding it in on itself it takes a little bit of work so just kind of keep doing it pinching around like so all right all right it definitely not glue anymore right you've made yourself this little polymer and this polymer is kind of cool so and then you roll it up into a ball, make a ball out of it. Guess what? The ball will bounce. All right. And um, if you take it and um, and like, if you want to look at your um, your um, Adventure Club logo on here, you should be able to. Once it kind of dries out a bit, just put it on here and press it down on that logo. Really good. Pressing, pressing. You gotta hold it down there for a while, okay? Don't don't pull it up right away. You don't want to look. You don't want to peek. Press it down on there, and you come up, and part of the logo will will show on your uh, on your silly bunny. And this will work with newspaper, comics, and and, uh, and other things as well. So anyway, so that is your silly bunny. Now you've got some extra borax solution, and of course, all you need is glue. Um, you can buy the pineal vinyl, polyvinyl alcohol at the, at the hobby store, um, or you can buy it online. Um, it's it's out there. In fact, you can even just buy green slime solution, as they call it, and you can uh, make more slime at home. So there you go. You have made slime and silly putty uh, and cosmic chemistry. And so now you're ready for trial number six.